Hello everyone. I am Harshita and in our previous sessions, we have completed that how we can create description rule, supporting references, accounting rule, journal line rule, and how we can uh, assign all these things in journal entry rule sets. And then we have created accounting method and we have attached the same or assigned the same in our ledger. So we have completed all these things and in today's session, what we are going to do, we are going to cover sub ledger accounting profile options. It is one of the advanced feature of sub ledger accounting. It sets value for each profile option to specify how Oracle fusion sub ledger application control access to and process data. So here are uh, some of the list of profile options available with the profile display name like diagnostic enable this uh, profile option help us to control whether transaction data used in accounting generation should be gathered for diagnostic then journal import disabled this uh, controls whether sub ledger journal entries are imported to journal ledger then enable transfer to oracle ebsgl it specify whether the target for transfer and post sub ledger journal entry in oracle e business view general ledger then the next is enable transfer to Oracle People of GL. Specify whether the target for transfer and post sub ledger journal entry in Oracle People of Journal Ledger. And the last is zero amount journal lines displayed. This shows zero amount journal lines. So these are some of the profile options available already in the instance. So what we will go do, we will go to the instance and we will see from which task you can see this profile options and set the same. So let's move to the instance now. So now after logging to the instance, let's go to settings and action, setup and maintenance. Give setup as fusion accounting hub. Give functional area accounting transformation. And if you want to search tasks directly, you can search by the name of the task or you can just scroll down and search for the task as well. And the task name is manage sub ledger accounting profile options here. Just blank search and all the profile options you can see which are available here. And we have discussed some of the profile options in the PPT. Let's go to them. So the first one was diagnostic enabled. Here it is profile option. It description, if you will read, it will say that controls whether transaction data used in accounting generation should be gathered for diagnostic. So this is profile option. Now what you can do is just select this profile option and scroll down a little bit below. And here you can see there are two profile values already added here. If you want to add anything else, you can just click on this add icon. And for removing, you can use this uh, icon for removing or deleting the row. Fine. So what is uh, profile level here? Profile level means at which level uh, one is setting the profile option. Like here, it is given at the user level. So you need to give who is the user and what will the profile value. You can give yes or no here as profile value. So this is how you are going to give your profile values here in the profile options and determine profile level as well. And if you are giving profile level as user, you need to specify username also. So here there are already two given uh, user. If you want to add any other, you can just click on this add icon as I have already told. And the next which we have seen in the PPT was journal import disabled. So here also one profile value is already added. Now the profile level can be given as site also. Profile level other than user can be given a site level as required and their username is not required. You can just give profile level as site and give a profile value here. So this is how you can do this. Fine and uh, for adding new one, you just need to click on this add icon. And what else we have discussed, we have discussed this. Enable transfer to Oracle EBSGL and enable transfer to Oracle People Sort. So, in the same manner, if you want to add anything, you just need to select this profile option and go to this add icon. And here, already select uh, added ones are 
visible. For this one also same thing. And the last one which we have discussed in the PPT was zero amount journal. So for that also same thing. You just need to select and you need to add here. You need to give the profile level, profile level at which one is setting the profile options and uh, give the other detail as required. So this was the very easy and small concept of uh, subledger accounting profile options in the Fusion Accounting Hub. So this was all about it. Thank you.